Geomagic Studio can easily convert point cloud scan data into a surface. The first step is to prepare the data by automatically detecting erroneous points or outliers so that they can be removed. Shading can be applied to the point cloud to make visualization easier. This way, certain details in the model can be seen before triangulation. The wrap algorithm can polygonize any point cloud, whether it is ordered or unordered, with a single click. This is a very powerful tool and is also a necessary step for creating surfaces from scan data. This function will work with large, dense scans as well as small, sparse point clouds. After wrapping, an industry-leading hole filling tool is used to replace areas of missing data. This tool is curvature based, meaning the surrounding area is used as a guide to create a smooth, continuous surface across the missing region. Minor imperfections in the polygon surface can be removed as well using tools like the feature. This is very useful for repairing small flaws in the part, or for smoothing rough spots. The sandpaper tool is another way of smoothing small areas. This localized smoothing command is interactive, and the more you move your cursor over a region, the smoother the result, much like rubbing your thumb over a clay model. The decimate function is an excellent tool for optimizing a polygon mesh. It will replace areas of small triangles with larger ones in an effort to reduce the overall number of triangles. This preserves quality while reducing file size and improving rendering performance. You will notice that in areas of highest curvature, such as where the window and the body meet, many more triangles are retained than on flatter regions like the window itself. The model is now ready for surfacing. One of the more unique features of Geomagic Studio is the ability to automatically create a NURBS surface on a polygon mesh. After setting a few basic parameters, a 12-step process is started to generate a network of watertight surface patches that will load seamlessly into any CAD, CAM, FEA, or CFD program. When complete, the user has a single surface comprised of multiple NURBS patches. The surface can then be exported via IGES, STEP, or VDA into any downstream application.